Hi guys, so now I'm going to show you on how to set up a local FTP on your computer. So it is important to set up a local FTP especially when you are developing something that is related to FTP especially if you have a slow internet connection so you don't have to test directly to the server so you can just test it on your local machine. Okay, so let's start. So I'm still going to use my virtual machine which is running a Windows 10. Okay. So let's type app with.cpl. Okay, so which will open the program and pictures. Okay, let's click again, turn on Windows pictures. Okay, let's maximize this. And then let's go under. IIS service and you can see here there is a FTP server so we just need to click here and then click OK to start the setup process okay so now it's done so we just need to click close and then let's just close this background pictures now we need to set up our FTP and now we just need to open our IIS manager. Click search I net MGR. Let's just maximize it and then maximize and here under sites let's just right click and then up add FTP site. Okay. For the FTP name, I'll just make set my FTP and then select a folder or a physical path. Okay, so I'll just select a folder. So I'll just select my FTP. Of course, you can create any folder name that you want. Okay, and click next. And then IP address, all assigned. Of course, including the local host 127 and of course, we don't have SSL. Let's click no. And then click next. And then anonymous. And then all users. And then read write. Okay. And click finish. Okay. So here is our FTP application. So to test, let's open a browser. Here I'm going to use uh, Microsoft Edge. Let's just type FTP and then slash one two seven dot zero dot zero dot one. Oops. Oh wait. FTP one two seven dot zero dot zero dot one. Okay. So as you can see, we are now browsing our FTP. So let's try adding a folder or a file inside our example file. Here my FTP. Let's just minimize this. Just create a folder sample. And then let's click refresh here so as you can see it reflects here and let's also create a file test point text okay let's click refresh okay so as you can see it's now our FTP is working so you can also use uh, any FTP client like Qt FTP or FileZilla to access this uh, FTP site. Okay, so thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, you learned something from this, and hopefully, it can help you to test or develop any application that is related to FTP. Thank you very much again.